We were talking about mayflies at the uh, Hannibal Riverfront Amphitheater attacking the Beach Boys. Mm -hmm. And And I have a mayfly follow-up. Okay. (laughs) Now listen, if this gets... Okay. I I, I was right, by the way. Mayflies do have non-functional mouth parts. Okay. Okay? So, yeah. How did you know that? I don't know why I know some things, but it's why I'm really good at trivia. Okay. (laughs) And I'm a curious person. I'm sure there's a lot of mayfly questions that come up in trivia. (laughs) I'm a curious person, (laughs) so I have to know more. So I looked up mayflies, and they are unique among insects, Jeff Dorsey. Mm -hmm. And if this gets to be too much for you, just use your power of the mute button. Oh, my goodness. (laughs) (laughs) Do you want to talk mayfly mating habits? We had had the same (laughs) discussion with the praying mantis, you know, know. Uh, a few months ago. <laughs> Mayflies are unique among insects in that both the males and the females have two sets of sexual organs. Really? Did you know? Yeah, when I got out of no. bed this morning, I asked that too. <laughs> so listen, mm-hmm. a female mayfly can, you know, give up one of her wombs to the male. <laughs> and the male can have a womb transplant. Oh boy, let's tie it all together today. <laughs> <laughs> and listen, since he still has his other sexual mm-hmm. organ, he, he can just go take care of things on his own. Mm-hmm. And then the female mayfly says, phew, don't have to deal with that. You know, I, I think when you drop that deodorant in your coffee, <laughs> it has affected you. Listen, I, 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 the more I think about this womb transplant thing, mm-hmm. the more I'm in favor of it. We're talking, again, if you missed it. About uh, they have the, they have the technology today mm-hmm. to transplant a womb into a man, and I think it's only fair that a man should have to experience the agony and pleasure of childbirth. <laughs> <laughs> Coming from someone who's given birth to two children at once without an epidural, I think that's just something a man should experience. Okay. Aren't you sad you missed that? <clears throat> no, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> But thanks for asking. And as we established, <laughs> since I'm done with my womb, I'm I you know I will put it up on eBay for any guy that wants it. <laughs> well, you do what you need to do. You know, we have the uh, have the weekly feature of the way I see it, but I think I'm going to defer to Sarah's editorial comment here this morning. On womb transplant <laughs> oh. and mating habits of the mayfly we are we are so for the people jeff we are for our listeners i don't know what i'm for after this conversation we we tell them things they just never knew and never knew they needed to know that is true now they now they're glad they know it Uh, not a truer statement has been said this morning all right you feel better now yeah because i was right i was right about the non-functional mouth parts of mayflies okay we've learned more than we ever thought we'd ever know about mayflies you know that (laughs) But this all started with the Beach Boys being attacked by them. <laughs> you know, it's the Beach Boys' fault. 